please hit that subscribe button. Hey, everybody. Better suited to win the Stanley Cup this season. If you are new to the channel, the Washington Capitals, the Boston Bruins. Locked out and he scores. And we're live. Hey, everybody. So it's time for NHL Games of the Week, where I look ahead at the upcoming week in the NHL and pick out which games I think will be the best and most fun to, and entertaining to watch this week. So before we start and get into it, I just quickly want to remind everyone to please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you are not yet a subscriber. Both of those things really, really help out a lot and are very much appreciated. Let's get into it here. The week of February 16th. Hard to believe it's already uh, February 16th. That is, uh, wow. Th this season is just absolutely flying by. We're going to have playoffs here before we know it. But we do have uh, a little bit of a regular season time left. And we've got some great games this week. As you can see, the board is pretty full. So this is a very solid week as far as uh, games of the week goes. Starting on the 16th. Uh, which is today, Sunday, with Boston versus New York Rangers. That's just always a really good matchup. Uh, Rangers aren't a playoff team this year, but they always play the Bruins well. And, uh, you know, that's just usually a really fun matchup when those two play. So that one should be a lot of fun. And then St. Louis versus Nashville. This is a huge game. Second uh, game of a home-and-home -home series between the two that they played yesterday against each other. Very physical game. Couple of fights. Uh, typical Central Division um, uh, you know, rivalry going on there. This this game's going to be fantastic as well. Uh, going to be close. Nashville fighting for their playoff lives. St. Louis fighting to try and keep the division lead. Uh, going to be an absolutely massive game. And Chicago versus Winnipeg. These are two teams fighting for to get into the playoffs who are currently outside of the playoff picture. Massive two points on the line in that. Oh, and their division rivals as well. Um, that's just going to be another huge, huge game between the Blackhawks and Jets. Moving on now to tomorrow, Monday uh, the 17th, I've got Tampa Bay versus Colorado. Now, I normally don't have cross-conference games as games of the week. I like rivalry matchups a lot better, divisional matchups a lot better. Um, but Tampa Bay and Colorado, this could be a Stanley Cup final preview. Uh, both of these teams playing very, very well. Colorado did take the loss in the Stadium Series game, but still very good over the, their last 10 games. Tampa Bay, the absolute hottest team in the league right now. Uh, lighting it up, 10 wins in a row. Um, that, that's a potential Stanley Cup final preview for this season and two of the top teams in the league. So it's going to be one hell of a game. Now we move on to uh, the 18th. We've got uh, Tuesday, Columbus versus Philadelphia in the first game of a home-and-home -home series between those two teams. Massive, massive playoff implications on the line. Both of them are in playoff spots right now. Both of them need... Or, uh, both of them are in wild card spots. Both of them need the two points. That's a huge, huge matchup between the Blue Jackets and Flyers. And then Toronto versus Pittsburgh. Uh, again, I'll be streaming that game. That will be our live stream this week, Tuesday night, Toronto at Pittsburgh. Just two you know, huge top teams in the East. Um, Toronto obviously hasn't had the season that they were expecting going in. But uh, Pittsburgh's one of the absolute best teams in the league, and Toronto has still has a ton of talent, even though they're maybe not the uh, the top tier team that we thought they could be this year. So that should be a really fun matchup. Now we're moving on to the 19th. I've got Arizona and Dallas. That's going to be a huge game. Uh, Arizona is fighting for their playoff lives. Dallas fighting for the division lead in the Central. Two huge points on the line for both of those teams. And then Minnesota versus Vancouver. Um, you know, Minnesota's another one of those Western Conference bubble playoff teams that desperately needs points. Vancouver needs to win this game. To, you know, they're looking to keep their lead in the Pacific. They've got teams like Vegas and Edmonton right on their heels trying to take that division lead away. Minnesota desperately needs it to, get in, to try and get into the playoffs. So that's an absolutely huge game. Uh, moving on to the 20th now, we've got... Um, Pittsburgh versus Toronto, again, back end of that home-and-home home series. And Philadelphia and Columbus, again, back end of that home-and-home home series. Everything I said about those first two matchups apply to their Thursday matchup as well. Uh, those are going to be some really, really awesome games to watch. 
Friday the 21st, we've got Nashville versus Chicago. Um, this is, again, two teams fighting for their playoff lives. Nashville and Chicago both currently outside the playoffs, but not by much. Still within striking distance of getting back in. They uh, will desperately need the two points in that game. And St. Louis versus Dallas. This is a divisional game in the Central. Two of the top teams in the Western Conference. This game could quite literally, depending on how the points go the earlier in the week, be for first place in the Central Division. Um, uh, you know, right now they're only separated by one point. St. Louis has the lead. This game, depending on how the rest of the week goes for both of these teams, could be for first place in the Central Division. That's an absolutely huge matchup. Uh, rivalry game as well between the Blues and Stars. Just everything. That, that might be the game of the week right there. And then finally on Saturday, we've got Carolina versus Toronto. Um, you know, again, we've got Carolina, first team out of the playoffs right now in the Eastern Conference. They're going to be fighting to get back in. Uh, they really want to be a playoff team again this year after making it last year, but it's going to be tough. There are a lot of good teams in the East this year, so uh, it's going to be hard for the Hurricanes to get in. They've got to be able to win big games like this one against the Toronto Maple Leafs to, to do that in Toronto. They're not safe in a playoff spot either. They could still end up possibly losing it to uh, um, Florida excuse me, down the stretch here in the Atlantic. If they they got to try and hold that third spot in the Atlantic to make sure that they get into the postseason. So two huge points there as well. So those are my games of the week this week. As you can see, there are quite a few. The board is pretty full. Uh, it's going to be a good week of hockey, and we are coming uh, really down towards the, the end of the regular season here. We're now you know midway through February. We've got you know March left, and then a little bit of April, and it's playoff time. So. Uh, obviously, the points are maximized at this point in the season. Every two points, every game is so important, especially for these teams you know, trying to improve their playoff position or even get into the playoffs at all. These are absolutely massive games. So with that, like, comment, share, subscribe, follow on social media. All those links are down in the description below. If you'd like to further support the channel, the links to our Patreon and merchandise store are down in the description as well. Keep spreading the word about this channel. Let's keep this thing growing. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'll talk to you guys soon.